I'm about 27 miles southwest of Denver uh, in a place called the Hogback Mountains. Now behind me is a natural stream pass through the Hogbacks, which leads from the Eastern Front Range region into the Western part. And most of the cuts between the Hogbacks, as it were, have been paved over by roads and pathways and so forth. This is one of the few natural passes. Now I'm here because a number of years ago, some colleagues of mine found some inscriptions or markings on the stone cave that we're going to be taking a look at real soon. At the time of this finding, there was a lot of controversy as to what the markings meant. Some scholars claimed they were simply the sharpening points of Native Americans where they would sharpen their stone tools. Other scholars suggest that they were some type of organized writing script. And I took a look at this a number of years ago and haven't been back in about uh, 10 years actually. And I'm here now to point out on video these particular markings and perhaps what they are. This is astonishing. There's nothing here. The markings have been removed. Someone came by and hacked out the piece of sandstone where these incredible striations and grooves were. All along this one area were markings, grooves, striations, cut marks, stuff that actually looked like organized script. In archaeology, we have a saying that we take only photographs, we leave only footprints. We never deface a property, we never deface artifacts. In the Western United States, where we are right now, uh, taking any kind of symbols or, or petroglyphs or anything of that nature is absolutely devastating, but it's also against the law to do that. We don't really know who put these markings here. Uh, there are some scholars who believe that they were done thousands of years ago by a, a visiting people. Some people claim they were Native American uh, symbols of some type. Whatever the issue is, we need to have these here so we can examine them with new technology as the decades move on. Rather disappointing morning uh, to drive all this way and to see that a rock site has been defaced, vandalized. Someone stole some petroglyphs, markings on stone. I wish this wasn't the case. 